The United States is set to announce new restrictions on China's access to its semiconductor technology. While not fully disclosed, some of the measures include curbs on shipments to China of chip-making equipment and AI chips. Min Soo Kyun has this report. The U.S. is expected to announce new measures aimed at restricting Chinese companies from gaining access to advanced semiconductor technology. Multiple sources report this week that the U.S. Commerce Department is set to impose fresh curbs on shipments to China of chip-making equipment. This means that to send such equipment to Chinese chip makers, U.S. companies would have to apply for a license, a measure amounting in practice to a ban. The new measures are also expected to include restrictions on exports of chips used in artificial intelligence. The controls are the latest move by Washington to thwart Beijing's tech ambitions and prevent its military advances. If China is unable to secure U.S.-made chip-making tools, it would hinder its ability to manufacture high-tech semiconductors. Also, limited access to AI chips would make it hard for China to develop new products that use cutting-edge technologies. The new restrictions aimed at countering China's growth in tech are also likely to affect South Korean chip makers with operations in China, such as Samsung Electronics and SK Hynix. This is because the same requirement for a license from the U.S. will apply to non-Chinese companies there. But an expert says the effects will likely be minimal. The U.S. is unlikely to take measures that would hurt South Korean chip makers operating in China. But the new restrictions could cause some inconvenience, as they would have to wait and undergo a license review before receiving chip-making equipment. Seoul and Washington have reportedly held talks regarding the issue and are expected to continue their discussions to ensure that the new measures do not adversely affect South Korean chip-makers. Min Suk-kyun, Arirang News.